Hey guys, how's it going? Toby here. Welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. Welcome back to the Deck of Cards Road to Glory series where we pick players to use in our Road to Glory using a deck of cards and a deck of cards only. It's pretty interesting and I do have a lot of fun using this one. And if you'd like to get some coins, check the link in the description for the fifashop.co.uk, a fantastic service that is fully automated on both consoles. And we do have a discount code to get you 10% off every single one of your orders, which is Toby10. I'll leave that down in the description as well. So we got an eight of diamonds in the deck of cards, which is the worst player on the eighth page. And we already had Leroy first, so the lowest one was Seamus Coleman. And that's actually pretty good because our right back was pretty bad. And Seamus Coleman is a fantastic BPL right back. So that was for our fitness team, which we're going to use for this game. And this guy, our opponent, has Remy, Balotelli, Dembele, Eriksson. A pretty solid BPL team with Wanfran at right back, which I have no idea why. But nonetheless, it is a pretty strong team. Now, I'm not a big fan of 4-4-2. We get a goal here through Eriksson. A cheeky little layup from the free kick. I always love doing that. I don't know why, because it's actually not that effective and I rarely ever score from it. So I was pretty lucky to get that goal. But I don't know, it's just, it looks kind of cool. It looks a lot better on FIFA 13. I think they introduced that on FIFA 13. It looks really cool, but it's kind of got nerfed, I guess, a little bit. Get a second goal and then he gets an equalizer. A lovely goal from Remy there. And this game was just so back and forth. And unfortunately, in the 90th minute, that goes in. And if you know, in the last episode, that kept happening to us. I keep getting players crossing the ball, like, along the floor, in the box, and it works every single time against me. It's so, so frustrating. Get a five of hearts, which is the worst player on the fifth page. If you don't know how it works, it's literally just red suit is the worst player, and then black suit is the best player on whatever page we get. And we do actually manage to get another fairly decent player. So this time, we're going to go for Oxley chamberlain to replace our right mid that we've currently got at the moment. And that's pretty good, because Salah doesn't have the best shooting, and he actually had no contrast, so it worked out pretty good. This is our second team that we do come up against a really strong Wolfsburg team, actually, and it just shows that they've actually got some pretty decent players, but this game was so boring, and I'm going to say something about this patch. I used to love this game. I actually really, really enjoyed FIFA. But this patch is genuinely really ruined it, and I'm so disappointed, like the game was so boring up until literally the 80th minute where I managed to score two goals and then he ended up rage quitting, like it was the most boring game I have ever played in my life. Nothing was happening and it was literally just a battle of who can not defend, because you don't need to defend, you actually just need to hover over your CDM and let the CPU do everything for you. It's so boring. Like, I don't, I don't even know. But let me know what you guys think about it. We're going to go for the third and final card draw in this episode. We get an eight of spades, which finally is the best player on the eighth page, which is not too bad at all. And that's actually Patrice Everett. Now, we've had Ogbonna at left back for about... 10 episodes and finally finally we get to replace him for an actual left back and he's pretty good as well cost me about 3.6k and this is the final team now this game my word i am going to be a bit salty about this one Laurie is a monster and i don't even know i don't know how it's a really good team anyway like that is a genuinely really strong team he's got hazard he's got sanchez van persie but what you're going to see here is pretty much a compilation, a montage of me shooting against Laurie and him saving every single one. Like, I don't understand. Some of these, yeah, they probably shouldn't have gone in. But literally, I can't understand how, just how, I didn't score at least one in this game. It was unbelievably frustrating. Maybe then I should have done something different, maybe... Maybe just power shot. I don't I don't even know. Like, I literally tried everything. Power shots, finesse shots, chips, the lot. And then in the 90th minute, he gets a penalty for that. I, I was so... I was actually really angry. Like, I don't get mad. I also dived to the right and nothing happened. So, apologies for a very salty Toby. But that game was really, really frustrating. But nonetheless, we're doing not too bad. And we are in Division 6. Well on our way getting up in the divisions i hope you have enjoyed this episode if you have leave a like and subscribe for some more but take care guys have an amazing day and goodbye